Hello Nerd Club, my name is Sebastian, today is Wednesday! Hey guys, so I figured this week I would do a kind of conspiracy style video because Tate did one that you should totally check out if you haven't seen already, and I wanted to do one. As I have something, I don't know if this is already a conspiracy theory or not, I feel like it could be, I feel like I've heard about it. But I tried to Google it and what I thought it was called, but I couldn't find it. So I don't know if it's a thing. I feel like it's a thing. But I have a story to tell. And now that's cr that has caused me to have this conspiracy theory. So it, what this happened on June 3rd, over the, June 3rd slash June 4th, it was like overnight in my sleep. It was my birthday party and Quinn was over and we were having a sleepover. I was asleep and I was dreaming and I dreamt that I woke up in the trailer where I fell asleep because we were camping in my trailer in our uh, driveway and Quinn wasn't there so I got up and I left the trailer to look for them and I went outside it was bright daylight and I walked down the street and for some reason I went to my friend Stephanie's house and I knocked on the door and was like hello Quinn anyone there Stephanie and Vic was there and Vic was like, and Vic was like hi and I was like what the what are you doing here because like I was dreaming and I was like same and then we were like maybe we met up because we were dreaming of each other and Vic agreed and then Vic suddenly Vic's I Vic kind of Vic kind of started stumbling and looking scared and he couldn't see and I was like what's happening he was like when I was dreaming of you I was having a nightmare and the nightmare is coming back so then the rest of the dream was me comforting Vic while there while he was saying stuff like like there's so much blood and why did you hurt her why did you kill her why did you slit her throat and then I woke up as I was I was trying to comfort Vic calm him down I calmed him down and then I woke up now that just seems like a really strange dream but no 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 it gets stranger so i would talk to vic on skype the next day and i didn't tell him about the dream but i was like did you dream about me last night and he was like yeah and i was like okay shouldn't freak out it's just a coincidence and then i was like was it a nightmare and vic was like yeah it was why and i was like oh and i was like uh did i per perchance kill and was anyone killed in the dream or something it was like did was there like blood did anyone die or something and Vic was like yeah you murdered my whole family and I was like oh because the blood blood everywhere thing he was saying in my dream and then did I slit anyone's throat was the last question I asked he said yeah in my dream you slit my mother's throat and he and I was just like what what okay my mind's blown so i told vic about the dream then i didn't tell him before because i wanted to get genuine answers because even though i knew vic wouldn't lie to me i just wanted to like, get the genuine facts even though i, I don't know I, he would have given me the genuine truth anyway but i don't know i just i told him afterwards okay no so after so when i told vic Vic was just like, I think it's a coincidence. And I was just like, it's not a coincidence. It's not a coincidence. Cause okay, like I can see two or three coincidences. And I'll just consider that a coincidence. But I have like a three strikes you're out rule for coincidences. And this has passed that rule. It has passed the three strikes, three coincidences. Cause we're both dreaming of each other at the same time. That's one. Vic was having a nightmare about me. Like he was in the dream, that's two. I had killed Vic's family, which explains there's blood, blood everywhere, that he said. And then I'd slit Vic's mother's throat in his dream, which explains why in my dream, he said, why did you slit her throat? So I think, like, I don't think that's a coincidence. I, I think our dream is met up or something. Somehow some dreamscape stuff happened. Cause like, I feel like that's too many coincidences. Like, and that's pretty specific coincidences too like those aren't general like the slit her throat thing that's pretty specific like that's not likely to be a coincidence so i don't know so now i just think that like dreams can meet up and people's dreams can like meet up if they're dreaming of each other at the same time i don't know if it always happens i don't know if it's a rare thing i don't know what's going on some illuminati stuff's going on but i just wanted to share that and let me know if you've ever had a weird dream like that like am i the only one what's going on i'm confused but now i have a conspiracy theory that just 
It's another one to stress me so, so much, along with the Mandela effect and just like the two universe. I think there's one about, one thing about like universes colliding and stuff that might be Mandela. I don't know. There's like another one and there's like a few conspiracy theories I follow. Lizard people and all that stuff. And now there's this one. Just Alright, so I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Be sure to like and comment and subscribe. And again, let me know if you've had strange dreams like these. Let me know I'm not alone. And until next time, peace. Wait, until next Wednesday, peace. I keep on messing up my outro. Like last time I said, see ya. What's going on? Okay, bye.